today I'm going to give you guys a tutorial on a couple of the different effects that you might want to use if you were to make like a ski movie type of edit or any other sport or any other kind of event. So the clip I have chosen to demonstrate the effects I'm going to show you is this clip of my dad skiing on Mount St. Helens. So first I'm going to play the clip so that you guys can watch it. So the first effect that I'm going to show you guys that is really important when you're making the type of video that we're making, which is um, a title. So the first thing you want to do is go from the editing tab into the graphics tab. In the graphics tab, there is a tool called the type tool. So you're going to want to hit that and create a text box. So now that I've created my text box, I can type whatever I want to type into it. So now that I've created my title, there's a few things you can do with it. You can go to selection tool and you can drag your cursor to enlarge the text box. And if you want to change your font size or style, you can go over into the graphics tab on the right side and hit font size and you can make it as big or small as you want to. I'm gonna move it back to 50. You can also change the font style. So you can make it bold, move it back to regular. And another thing you can do, which could be helpful when you're doing transitions is you can change the opacity of the text so you can make it as light or dark as you want to. You can also use these different tools up underneath align and transform to change the centering and the alignment of the text box. Okay, so the next thing I'm going to show you guys is underneath the color tab. So when you're making a ski movie or any sort of movie like this, some, any sort of edit, you might want to change the colorization of the clip. So for this clip, I want to just make it a, a little bit more vibrant and a little bit more um, sharp. So I'm going to go into Okay, I'm going to go into this color tab. So up here, you can change the saturation, the vibrance, you can sharpen the image, or you can fade it. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to increase the saturation a little bit to give it a more dramatic effect. 
and I'm just gonna see what it looks like when I increase all of these, sharpen it a little bit. So I think that looks good. So I'm gonna go back to editing. And the last thing that I wanna do, which I think is the coolest little trick that I've learned, is you can right click and it opens up this menu where there are a lot of options, but you go down to Oh, you go down to speed slash duration and you select that and then you can change the speed of your clip. So what I, my vision for this particular clip was to have it be this slow motion sort of dramatic clip of my dad skiing. And I wanted to do that because it's this perfect angle as he comes down and he passes me and then I want it to look just sort of dramatic. So I'm going to change the speed to 50%. And then I'll show you what that looks like. I'm just starting at 50 and I'm going to see what it looks like. And if I like it, I'll keep it but I might have to adjust it a little bit more. And I think that looks pretty good. So that's my tutorial and thank you for watching.